Hey guys, welcome to Home Theater 101. Today I want to talk to you about how to clean your 3D glasses. And um, this is specifically important to people who have passive 3D glasses or the polarized kind. And um, the one thing, I know this may seem kind of elementary, but it is kind of important. Um, you know how you take a pair of glasses like this and you'll take either sides and just go back and forth like that. Well, the problem is with these glasses, um, the way they're constructed, if you rub them together, you're basically pushing two bits of film together and you'll scratch your glasses. Um, fortunately, these, uh, I picked them up for basically a dollar a piece on Amazon. Um, if I can find a link, I'll put it in there. But um, so they're not incredibly expensive. So if you do scratch them, it's not the end of the world. Unlike uh, if you have active glasses, you know, the kind that are like 20 and 40 bucks a piece, um, then you'll then you'll care. Um, but fortunately, I mean, these things are nice and cheap. But what you want to do is you want to clean one side at a time. OK, one side at a time. That way you're not putting pressure against both sides. And you don't want to put a whole bunch of pressure on it when you're doing this. Um, and this is using a, a good uh a cloth that's meant to clean glasses um, and lenses and stuff like that. So that's ideal too. I mean, if you're using a Kleenex, that's all right, but you're probably going to wear them down a little bit quicker that way. Um, but again, fortunately, they're inexpensive. But um, basically go through and, and, and wipe them down like that, and uh, that'll get you some clean glasses without scratching them up. So, uh, but this is one of the reasons I talk about why it's good to get a, uh, a passive 3D TV rather than a, an, an active one. Because, you know, if you drop these or smash them or someone sits on them or whatever, not a huge deal. You know, you get a pair of 20 or $40 glasses that came with your TV. Um, not only does it get expensive when you have people over to watch a movie, but uh, something happens to them, you can get pretty bent out of shape. So, um, you know, getting a passive TV kind of... Uh, kind of takes care of that. So anyway, that's just a quick tip on how to clean your 3D glasses. For more tips like that, please subscribe to my channel and hopefully I'll produce more uh, useful content for you guys. Thanks again. I appreciate you watching.